Hi, this is Caddy AI and it's epic. Let's check it out. I've gone to caddy.syr.ai to show this. You're seeing the uh, client side to the front of all of that discussion there. And one thing that's important is it supports multiple large language models, not only the ones from OpenAPI, it also supports ones from Anthropic, which is Claude. And these two here are ways of running uh, large language models arbitrarily that you have in your own system. That could be uh, Lambda from Google, it could be Llama from Meta and anything you like. And then within each provider, various options for which model you like to use. This means you've got options even within options. And then here, and this is configured for a financial firm, you can do something of uh, additional step, which is to give a persona to your responses not only knowing everything about your company and knowing that any person at your company may respond differently based on their role there are roles here so with this user interface it means that everything that's going on is also in your control so if i open up the what control can look like then it's knowledge about what's happening even if it's not me personally using it. If I'm an executive at one of these, I have the ability to access this dashboard that tells me, well, what are the costs involved? Uh, if I set it up for multiple users, which user is asking and making which request? So it's all basically real time. I've been able to ask some questions the other day and I can see exactly when those were and if I ask it something like uh, well let's see what is the meaning of life as the example to the default then the meaning of life is philosophical and it gives you whatever it wants to tell you it's going to show up here and be available for multiple purposes I suppose when you're looking at the how do you call it, maybe data leakage. You don't want anybody in your company putting sensitive questions in there. No matter what, you've got to have people understand and know what is uh, appropriate versus what's not. And here we are uh, seeing exactly that it's ChatGPT, it's trained on this type of stuff, and then it's being given the meaning of life prompt, and it shows back what the ChatGPT response was. You can open a new conversation with an accountant and uh, ask it uh, this example question, a nice one. What's the difference between accrual and cash basis accounting? And we get back accrual and cash basis, etc., as the options that anyone might want to know within here. There are many in terms of Helicone AI. It's all a uh, third-party provider. Uh, at this point here where we're getting into the tools, we're getting deep into it. And there's a lot to get into. So it all starts with the idea of your business and you'd like to have control. You'd like to know everything going on. You'd like to have a sense of the future embedded in your, that's a good thing to say. Let me pause just to say, I prompted it with, you are an accountant for an accountant. And folks can write two page prompts for this. There's a whole idea of making personas that is out there in the world and with the 
better input, then these things can be shown to the public. If you make statements that say, if you don't know the answer to something, say, I don't know, then you can plunk this on a public-facing part of your site and give it to customers as a, fine, and you can watch it all. But let's do this here. Great. It's me again. Hi. This is all very new. I'm building this. My team's building this. I'm building this with collaborators for some anger with Silicon Valley. I call them Silicon Valley schmucks. They've done a lot in the past years to rob a lot of data out the back door from free products. So to me, it's a response to that in a social and civic way to do for Syracuse that has given me so much. It's my adopted home. And with my skills as an engineer and my team behind me, Caddy AI will do a lot for your business. That was unthinkable just months ago. All right. Get out of here.